What up, what up? This is your boy Checo. This is your boy Noi, what up? And this is Compass Unfiltered. Thank you guys for listening, for watching. Make sure you guys follow all of our social media. Subscribe and like. And make sure you go rate us on Apple Podcasts, Spotify. Make sure you drop a comment on YouTube. Uh, like and subscribe. Yes, sir. Enjoy the episode. Uh, welcome back to another episode, episode 138. Um, we have some returning guests and f- I guess kind of like an official we already, you guys already know, these are our sponsors. Are our thank sponsors. you for coming back, like, Javita. Oh, thank you for having us. Gracias, gracias. Welcome, welcome, welcome. ¿Cómo han estado? Bien. Todo bien, todo bien al cien. Yeah. Vi- vivos mm-hmm. y con salud, es lo más importante. Eso es lo mejor que pueda haber. Yeah. 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 Um, este, I, I do want to get a little bit into religion if you guys want to. Yeah. Porque now that I know que mi compa Gio es este hey. religioso. Casi pastor. <laughs> <laughs> no me creo, pues. <laughs> Pero toda su vida así es cristiano, a mí fue fue creído así. Mi familia más que todo fue creada, uh, bueno, son muy así cristianos. Ellos son muy religiosos. Pero este, yo no practico así tanto la religión, pues. Como no tiene una iglesia ni nada. No, no, no tengo iglesia ni nada de eso. We don't Pero go. sí, sí creo en Dios, creo en todo eso. Pero se considera cristiano. Uh, hasta sí. Oh. Hasta cierta parte, porque para ser cristiano, cristiano tiene que, bueno, según yo, tiene que practicar todo lo, como lo de la religión, ir a la iglesia y todo eso. Tener una comunidad, pues. Sí, correcto. Pero cada quien interpreta como como quiere todo eso, ¿me entiendes? ¿Por qué no ha sido este, como ir a la iglesia, ir más seguido por el tiempo? ¿O no está de acuerdo con unas de las cosas que hace la iglesia? Uh, o? Sinceramente, compa, ahora en día, este, no, no, las iglesias en día ellas mismas se entienden casi. Si se fijan una, una con otra, se, como que se pelean, se tiran tierra y uh, no, no estoy de acuerdo en eso. Yo creo que hasta la iglesia a uno, uno mismo la lleva en el alma, compa, y, y como se porte así le va a ir. No, compa, ir... 24-7 a una iglesia a confesarse y a decir cosas y en realidad no lo siente. Es más tener la relación con Dios o con quien tú crees, you know? Uh-huh. Sí, porque pues cada quien cree en su, en su, en lo que quiere creer, pues. Sí, como yo soy, yo me considero católica y tengo mi relación, you know, yo creo en la Virgen de Guadalupe, uh, you know, so, hay otros uh-huh. que creen en otros, you know, San Judas, or. Yeah, otros, you know. um, ¿cómo se dice, compa? Santos. Yeah. Santos. There you go. Maybe. I was like, trying to think of the word. But you don't follow it either, huh? Like I see, este. No. Mm-mm. Okay. Mm-mm. I no. go to church and. No. Yeah, no. When was the last time you went? Somebody's baptism? Mm, I think a 15. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Close enough. Más peda. Yeah. <laughs> Más peda. Yeah, pretty much. No, I don't know. I just feel like, like I said, like, personally, <clears throat> I mean, cada quien, ¿verdad? Obviamente, builds their thing. I think it would be nice to go. Don't get me wrong. Like, I wouldn't mind going, but I just feel like, if I'm still gonna commit a sin or decir cosas like pendejadas, like yo tengo una boca suelta, you know, si me criaron con pa- palabras malas. ¿Para qué vas a ir si vas a andar a decir, ah, esto que esto, you know? Yeah. I don't know, I just don't think it's. Como like, si no lo vas a cambiar, no quieres yeah. ir a yeah. put up a front. Yeah, exactly, you know? Mm-hmm. Voy a andar diciendo pendejadas, a... no hablando de la gente, porque pues todo lo hacemos, ¿verdad? son comentarios, pero en, gen- en general, maldiciones. Yeah. You know? That's a big thing for me, pues. But you don't want to change it either. No. You're like, I'm okay. Yeah. I have my relationship with God, you know? Like, I'm not that type of person where, like, I don't look I don't look for him when I need it. Like, yo siempre, antes, cuando me subo al carro, antes de irme a un lugar, yo siempre me persino. Es una cosa que yo siempre lo vi mi abuelito hacerlo y me encucó <coughs> siempre persinarte y yo tengo mi rosario, you know? So, I it's just a rub because I have it hanging on my thing. I Me persino and then I rub it. Just, you know? I feel like it's a thing that, that's, I've just always done that, you know? And it's not just like when you're about to get in the highway or whatever. It's just it's all the time. Yeah, anytime when I yeah. act, when I get on the car, mm-hmm. every time I grab it, I go like this, me persino, and then you know, say, llévame mi camino y regresame con bien. ¿Y usted, compa, cuando la ve que hace eso, qué dice? No, pues yo respeto todo, compa. Oh. <laughs> 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 en otras like, palabras, tengo miedo. Sí, he, no, he pero... <laughs> Pero mi religión es un poquito diferente. Yeah, por eso le pregunto, like, what, 
Like, ¿La ves y qué dices? Like, oh. No, pues por eso. ¿No, no, ¿No la quieres nada. guiar bien al no. buen camino? No, pues si ese es el buen camino para ella, se respeta. <risa> <risa> yeah, sí. sí, por eso te sí. tienes sentado acá, compa. No, por eso no te pudiste sentar poquito, allá. Un poquito alejado, porque <risa> cuidado. <risa> 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 That's funny. I want to say I think I have a bad habit de eso de like para rezar o, o persinarme. Ajá. I, like how we had Hugo on. Ajá. Cuando ando oh, pedo. Cuando ocupas algo. That's when I do it. Yeah. Y está mal. Está it, mal. It, it pero. Is, but it's normal. You know what I mean? I feel like every Hispanic is like that. You know what I mean? Oh my gosh, cupo que esto but, or something bad going on. And they're like, oh por Diosito Santo, por favor, cuídalos o protégelos mm -hmm. or ayúdanos or, you know. Como nomás se acuerda de I think it's common, but I don't yeah. think que no tiene que ser normal. Mm -hmm. I feel like, pues, like you said, yeah. you should have, you should nurture your, your relationship with God. Yeah. Si right. tienes que echarle ganas de tener una relación. Yes. Like, no nomás cuando lo ocupes, right? Sí, sí. sí. Pero, pues sí, yo pienso que es más común de la gente que nomás así, uh -huh. o somos así, you es, know? Es común de la gente yeah. que, que hace esas cosas. Que hasta ya cuando lo, te ves en un apuro, you're like, oh Ahí my God, mojado, you know? Ahí Diosito, y de ayúdame. Yeah. Yeah. Y es yeah. malo, como dice, pero I feel like it's, Like, como digo, no tanto normal, because it shouldn't be normal, but yeah. it's una costumbre que uno tiene, you know, unless you were ra like raised going to church and, you know, you know the scriptures, you know all this, like, you know when to ask for things or what not to ask. But I feel like even people that get into it, like, oh, you're, um, cuando pides algo que dicen que a un santo, lo que sea, no le compres, ya estás haciendo brujería. Or estás haciendo... Some people take it like that. Like, oh, ¿por qué estás pidiendo esto? Sí. Pues nomás el compa Gio. Ahí va. ¿El compa Gio? Ahí va, compa. Porque no creen los santos, right? Mm, no, nah, la verdad no, compa. Yeah, pues por eso le digo, yeah. I know, I'm, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Y, y, Yo creo. Funny, no lo dice ahorita porque estamos en vivo, lo que sea, pero él, a él le da risa cuando dice, yo lo digo o lo que sea. No para juzgarlo, porque no lo juzguen. Es, es normal. Uh, it's just different. Para la gente yeah. que es cristiana, que no cree en santos, para tú, como tú ver a alguien que cree en santos y dice, oh, mi virgencita me cuida, o ella uh -huh. me ha cumplido cosas que yo le he prometido, o lo que sea. Like, pero es like, bro, like, it's just a mono. I'm like, well, If you're going to say it that way, well, God is a mono too because you don't know how God looks or Jesus or whatever. Because mm -hmm. yo hasta hace unos años um, uh, entendí mucho de las religiones because, like I said, we grew up on it, but it wasn't something that they explained to you. Like, and it, people might judge me and think I'm stupid, but I, I didn't know about it. So I didn't know there was a difference between God and Jesus. Like, para mí, creciendo cuando tú dices, oh, Jesús o Dios, like, yeah. era una persona. You know what I mean? I didn't know it was two different people. You know, and it's like not until you get into religion you understand little things like that, you know? Like the Holy Trinity and all yeah, that. Yeah, like, you know, Ay, es que, people don't know. Sinceramente, cada quien este interpreta eso como But I think religion is beautiful. Todas mm -hmm. las religiones son hermosas en su diferente way, like um what's a like a Baptist, um mm -hmm. Buddha you know, peace and love, and, you know. They all have a good message in yeah. one way or another. Yeah. Sí. Lo importante es creer en Dios y... No, que seas una persona buena. Sí, you know? también. Yeah, that's that's one. Una persona that's buena. One. Y si vas a ser una persona mala, like, well, that's you, right? Whatever, just... I feel like the older you get, you tend to understand things, like, don't care what people say about you, or, you know, like, don't get me wrong, we all judge everybody, but at the same time, it's like, who are you to judge? You know what I mean? And if you are, well, look at your life. You know, why are you judging people? Is your life perfect? No, it's not, you know? Porque no importa que este, seas una persona que vas todos los días a la iglesia y, y tienes sentimientos podridos y... Ya vale más. Sí, ¿Eh? no, 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 no haces nada en ir a perder mm -hmm. tu tiempo nomás. Y si vas a ir a hablar de las personas a hacer, y luego saliendo a hacer cosas malas, ah, pues no, no, no se puede pues así. No, pero para la gente que sí le ayuda ayudado y cambiar su vida mm -hmm. como este como dice el compa Carlos para agarrarte de algo yes. mm -hmm. I'm all for it bro it's nice. sí. it's, está bien I think it's beautiful because it's gonna help you change I feel like that's it's awesome man makes you a better person and it makes you feel good because como dice you go through so much and then to finally find something that's you that helps you mm -hmm. good yeah um Talking about religion, pero a little bit into conspiracy. No sé si se, se meten ustedes en eso. Yeah. Uh, at least on, for me on TikTok. Mm -hmm. One story that I heard um, when Jesus este, turned water into wine, mm -hmm. that that was like a party trick. It wasn't 
like it was it was just because like um somebody had told him like do something cool uh-huh. and that's what he did mm-hmm. i don't know if he has ever I heard, never of that. heard i've it. never heard no. of that but to get to people to drink or like just be- because the party was kind of lame i guess this guy. <laughs> I swear, bro. And <laughs> not that I believe hey, it. You're but gonna have just to post like, that TikTok. So I don't people care. Can yeah, see I'll put. Yeah, yeah, I'll post it. Yeah. Now we got AI, bro. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. You're gonna have to put it up yeah. to yep. get you to. Like, ya se había la tequila, to see how sinful como... you are. Yeah. I mean, I just feel like if you really think about it, it's like they consider you drinking a sin, but it's not because in church, like. But then vino. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You just so, tienes que tomar con moderación. Uh huh. No más te dan un poquito. No, que te dan la botella. Va a estar como la rola. Pásame la botella. Andar cante y cante. Ay, ay, ay. Ey, ay, ey, ¿quieren que canten, compa? Denle una no, cola a la raza. A ver sí, si no sí. canta. Ay, no. Um, well, talking about a little bit into conspiracy, I don't know si han visto lo que ha pasado que with Cat Williams. Oh, yeah. And all over TikTok. I haven't seen his uh, full, um, the, the, el, el... the full video, but the stuff he's saying about people. What do you think? I think you like stuff like that. That's why I, I bring do, it up. Yeah. Eso, eso I, I believe it, man. I, I believe it because I'm just like, I feel like all that, like, um, what do they say? Like the whole drama with Jada and, or and Will Smith. Smith. Yeah. I believe that too because I'm like, why would they make that stuff up? You know what I mean? Y ya no es su asistente. You know? He left. Yeah, el otro and mucho. I feel like that's what happens when you're like close to someone and you guys, something happens and you fall apart. You're going to spill pe- each other's secrets. You know, because you're mad, you're you're angry. You're like, fuck this fool, like, fuck that. I'm gonna say all the shit I can to make him look bad. You know? Did but, you watch the episode though? Yeah. With the. Uh... No, I I haven't finished it. I only watched a little bit, but I've seen like clips of the stuff that she was saying and like all that stuff. He got murdered. <laughs> well, no, not really, right? But... <laughs> oh, he got murdered. <laughs> I was trying to explain to him about it, nah, pero no. Esos desgraciados están locos. <laughs> Hicieron di- billetes de más, ¿ah? ¿eh? Hey, esos ya quedaron locos. No, ya. le dio todo el billete. Por oh, la no, yeah. <laughs> no, no, pues. Estaba tomando bad light, por, compadre. Estaba no, no, tomando no, bad light. Will Smith. Will Smith. ¿Te acuerdas? El del yeah, que salió en no. Pursuit of Happiness. Yeah, That's yeah. his favorite movie. Oh. Yeah, it's a good movie. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever seen it? Yeah, no, I haven't seen, seen it. it. The Pursuit of Happiness? No, you know okay, that's on your bucket that list. That one? Really that one. You're going to cry. Muy yeah. Sentimental. Did you cry, compa? Nah, but I watched it. <laughs> yeah. That's chill. It's good. It's a good movie. Hey. Yeah. Well, um, I mean, mostly all Will Smith movies are really good. Yeah, that's true. Pero que andaban haciendo sus movidas por detrás los güeyes. Es su rollo, da? Cada quien, compa. Sí. Cada quien. Pero no, back to the Si así son felices... <laughs> oh, si God, yeah, yeah. God, yeah. Pero, no, um, I didn't see a lot of stuff, but like, I mean, that just goes to show because when he was talking about stuff, how did all these people start coming out talking that you haven't seen? You know what I mean? Like, um, the rapper, oh my gosh, I'm so bad with names, but there's like a comedian, El que salía en los Browns family, I think. I don't know. There's just a lot of actors that came that up came speaking, up. and it's like, si no tuvieran miedo, why'd they come up to speak? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know? Y hay gente que le contestó ¿va? A, a Cat Williams, uh-huh. pero nadie negó de lo que estaba diciendo. They were just saying he was a hater. Mm-hmm. But no one said, no, he's lying. That's crazy. That like Luda true. didn't say that, right? He just yeah, rapped. that was one of them. Yeah, he, Luda Chris? Yeah. That's what you were talking about? Yeah, yeah I forgot. I mean, he, I only saw the, the rap real mm-hmm. quick, you know? But no, he didn't say nothing like it's fake or something. Yeah. I mean, Kevin Hart también este posted on Twitter. Again, and, he didn't he didn't deny it. He just said he's he's jealous and he's a hater. We want to interrupt this episode to give a huge shout out to our sponsors like Jaivita with some of the best Mexican food in Aurora. If you like that combination, tacos, burritos, quesadillas, with mariscos as well, seafood broils, ceviche, aguachiles, the other spot to go to. 100% recommended from your boys from Compas Unfiltered. I definitely love the fucking taco mixtos. So if y'all want to go ahead and try them, let them know that Compas sent you. You might get a discount. Maybe not, but it's still worth the drive. Go out there, check them out. The homies from La Jaivita in Aurora, 1031 Ridgeway Avenue, Aurora, Illinois. Go check them out. Let's get back to this episode. That's perdido, ¿verdad? No, no sabe de qué estamos hablando. No. Yeah, sorry, bro. Hombre, sí sé, sí sé. Pero pues, sí está canejo. Yeah. I don't know. I just feel like being in Hollywood makes you do some crazy shit. I, I believe all that stuff about selling your soul to the devil and all that bullshit. I think it's true. I think I think so. I think mm-hmm. what they're doing and what they've done and is bad. 
Because haven't you guys seen that one with um? My gosh, I'm so bad with names. I forgot his name. Uh, David Dobrik, where he mm. um they interviewed him, where one of his friends they told her that if she wanted to get into because she wanted to be famous and somebody came to her and was like, oh, Mimi here and you have to go to a party or I don't really know too much. I forgot because it's been a while since I watched it. But if you find he <clears> talks <throat> about like that conspiracy about selling your soul to the devil. What do they call it? The Illuminati. Yeah. Illuminati. Uh huh. But I think that a veces eso de, like selling your soul is <laughs> not literally selling your soul, right? It's more like haciendo cosas que no estás de acuerdo against your own morals, your own values, you uh -huh. know, because like Cat Williams was like, he's just against que uno se puede, que, que ponga un, un vestido, un hombre. Like, that's against his thing. Pero you see people for like Halloween, guys, they'll wear a dress quick mm -hmm. with no money. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Sí, so, pero como él lo está viendo, como que te están forzando a, like, not just to look like a woman, bro, but to take your manhood away by doing that in a movie. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Yeah. But I'm saying, there's, there's taking people, away your masculinity, pues. Por eso digo, hay, hay gente que do it for free. Kevin Hart, yeah, that's true. So, but Kevin Hart, but they're doing it for free for like the block on Halloween, dog. Like, it's not a movie. It's not the world. That yeah, it, but this is millions of dollars. I mean. I guess. I mean. You know what I mean, though? Like, it. The only thing that makes it weird is that like all, the, all these uh, African-American actors that do it, right? Like, they're always like, oh, he did it, he did it, he did it. But. A lot of white actors do it too. They all do it to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's like, but they're not bringing those people up. You know, it's like, well, if you really think about it and go back to all the white actors that are really famous and really good actors, mm -hmm. have they done it? And like, how many compared to African American or Latino or whatever, mm -hmm. like, how many have done it? Y, yeah. Si casi es lo mismo, pues, it's just a role. You know, like maybe it's just it happens. There was this podcast I was listening to, and I don't know who <clears> they are, but they were talking about how that you could tell that Bad Bunny he sold his soul or whatever the hell. Because well, of how he acts, his type of music, the openings, and, like, all that stuff. So, it's, like, little things like that. I feel like everybody determines it differently when you say, okay, he sold his soul or whatever. Mm -hmm. Pues, sí, se me hace, a mí se me hace weird porque ya cuando llegan a cierto punto de su carrera, sí, están en las fotos igual, like, con señales o parados yeah. igual. Like, o you know, yeah, eso sí, or, yeah. like, you know? or even, like, the where they're standing on their album covers, they están cuadritos mm -hmm. and, like, just weird things that when you go back to history and you look and you research that, si sale, oh, si es esto diabólico, yeah. a lo que como sea. Usan mucho el símbolo de la cabra. Como, sí, mm -hmm. Si sí. se fija el símbolo de la cabra, tiene sus, según tiene sus, sus creencias o... No su sé, historia. Pues, su historia diabólica, pues, más que todo. Yeah, and I feel like pues ya cuando pones todas esas cosas juntas, you're like, right, that's mm -hmm. weird. You know, yeah. like, why why stand that way? Why throw up that sign? Why, yeah, you know? Y por qué tan tantos mm -hmm. desde antes? You know, you're like, qué rollo. Mm -hmm. yeah. Sí, como que muchas cosas no, no cuadran. No. Nah. But I feel like it's it's true, though. Like, if you want to become famous, I mean, <coughs> some people have been fam become famous because, I mean, I feel like nowadays you could become famous if you do something stupid or even if you do something good, you know? It's just yeah. all about mm -hmm. you, shows, people, que they support you. But I feel like the generation now, they kind of like, they're minded, they're... They're more open-minded? Yeah, they're more open-minded and they see things differently. Or they actually see what's mm -hmm. going on in the world. Because antes, like, I feel like we didn't pay attention to this shit back in the days, like, because there was not a lot of social media or, like, stuff where you could... There wasn't a lot yeah. of information out there. Yeah. Yeah. Ya ahorita ya la información te la. Yeah. Donde Just quiera, TikTok. donde quiera hay información. Well, I feel like TikTok is everybody's source. <laughs> I mean, it is. Fine. For me, for me, it is. Honestly, <laughs> yeah. Yo, yo, yeah, TikTok. Another thing on TikTok. I don't know if you guys saw the thing in Miami. I was just about to ask you that. You were watching that stuff. <laughs> Segu, I was, yeah. Le estaba hablando a él de eso. Mm -hmm. He's like, do you believe it? I was like, what did you hear? He said he heard that some people were um, like shooting or something. I heard that there was a fight broke out. A fight, yeah. But the, the, the real thing is they saw like... Yo escuché like, que aliens. alguien había prendido este... Cuetes, ¿no? Cuetes adentro. Fireworks. Y, y que llegaron muchos reportes que había tiroteo. Por eso llegó el montón de policías. Otros dicen que extraterrestres. Mm -hmm. no, no se le entiende, pues. I don't know. Sí. Did you see the video, papá? No. I haven't been on TikTok, bro. No. I haven't been on social media that much. Pues lo que pasó es que en un mall, ¿va? Mm -hmm. En in, in, uh, Florida... Uh, reportaron que there were some kids fighting, fist fighting or whatever. And I guess they were also blowing up cuetes. Mm -hmm. But a lot of cops showed up. Like a lot. Like the entire Miami police force showed up. Mm -hmm. For kids fighting, mm -hmm. that's a lot of cops. Y no sé qué, como un chingo, un chingo de patrullas. Sí, salieron muertos o no? 
No. No. They and, just showed up. And they shut everything down. And they arrested two kids, I think. That's, That's it. Weird. But somebody else posted that it was like a projector or some shit like that. I don't know. I saw so many videos. La gente ya ve que una vez empiezan a decir cosas que teorías, pues a veces. That sounds like a waste of resources, but you know, no, 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 It really is. Yeah, I saw that and I was like, I don't know if it's an actual alien, because I mean, this is a thing too. Cada vez que supuestamente un alien o vieron algo, mm. pinches cámaras valen, porque you no can't see ve. anything. No yeah. se ve, está borroso. Está todo borroso. Como that kid that saw it in back of his Pero yard or ahorita, yeah. ahorita hay muchos diciendo que es como para cortina de humo. Ya ve que ya acaban de sacar la lista de esos güeyes que... Oh, si me conectes. Yeah. Sí, que hay muchos poderosos ahí metidos en esa, en esa cosa. Que como cortina de humo para que la gente se distraiga, ¿verdad? Yo pensé que su lista ya había salido. O esa no era la real one. There was like, uh, there was certain people that were like, oh, they were on the flight list. Mm -hmm. Pero the full list hadn't gone out. Oh, so but no, there was like no, certain no. names like, oh, Bill Clinton has been on there. Mm -hmm. they, they knew that they had flown in the plane. Yeah. Pero la lista en sí todavía no salía. Yeah. La que tenía la corte. Mm -hmm. Y ahorita mm -hmm. ya salió. Hey. Well, Stephen Hawking, bro, everybody was clowning like, what? Stephen Hawking was on there? Y ahorita the dude in the wheelchair or whatever? Yeah, 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 the... yeah. Están diciendo muchos que porque están sorprendidos que ya ves que a Michael, Michael Jackson le tiraron mucho que era de hey. eso sí pues este uh, Como pero están sorprendidos porque no apareció en la lista según. So no apareció en la lista? No apareció. Oh, shit. Que todos están diciendo, no, que disculpa los Michael, que ellos pensaban que estaba sí, automáticamente. Uh, y todos decían que Donald Trump también estaba ahí en esa lista y tampoco. Y no salió. No salió. Y lo que salieron fue el Clinton, el Bill Gates, Stephen Bill Hawking, Gates. Clinton. Uh, there was another. Jay-Z. Jay-Z was Jay -Z on Jay-Z and Beyonce, I think. Yeah. Came on the, yeah. yeah. Wow. Simón. Yeah, it was crazy. No, I'm very fucking. No, these people are some powerful fuckers. Y no sé si es, I think I saw it también, um, Chris Tucker. Y Cat Williams dijo que, que Chris Tucker no es el mismo Chris Tucker from Back Friday, from Black in the Day. He's like, they, they, we have the Epstein Chris Tucker right now. And I think he came out on the list. And that's crazy. Mm -hmm. What does crazy that even shit? mean, right? I don't know. Mm -hmm. That's like, what I Cat Williams no, no explicaba muy bien. You know what I mean? Like, he just, we would just say things. And I just, just feel like because he can't say certain shit, he right. only could say what, like, to an extent. Because, like... When you speak out, your life's in danger, especially being in Hollywood. You see something stupid that the sort, like, you know, you're not supposed to say. Ya, ya te, te cargó el diablo, o te cargó el payaso. Te cargó el payaso, como dicen. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> so. Oh, yeah, he put a lot of people on blast, Tony Paquet. A lot of hey. people. That is true. Pero no les van a hacer nada porque son los que mueven todo el, todo el vinchilo ahí. Imagínese el, el, el Clinton. ¿Qué le van a hacer a ese güey? O oh, a esas personas no lo hacen. Yeah, no. A los que están en la lista, ya. Yeah. yeah, los que están en la lista, no, no. No, lo, owns, no los tocan para everything. nada. Pero como a Epstein sí lo quebraron, compadre. Eh, no, pues porque estaban a lo, en la cárcel. A, a lo mejor chingan. Chingan a los más, a los más que están vulnerables, que, no, que los pueden Pues este, quién lo iba chingar, a proteger, pues? estaban en la cárcel. Sí. You know? He was done. Y mm -hmm. callando a ese güey, pues ya se acaba todo. Hey, que no supieron de dónde vino tanto dinero, right? Like, they can't track Ay. it, where it came from. Like, how much, Ay. you know? They have a... I watched the Netflix <clears throat> series about him, and they didn't really talk about much about that. I don't know if there's other series about him. Do you guys know? The Netflix? No, that's the, the one the, I saw. Epstein? Yeah. No, you know, must be uno. That's the that one was, I saw, that's, too. That's the one? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. There was, I forgot who, where they were talking about it. I think it might have been in TikTok, the property I had, that they, he had in Arizona. Mm -hmm. Like, dude, it was like a crazy, crazy big property, bro. Like, on like on its own, that you you just like, damn. Yeah, and they like, like little island. Yeah, and people. So that was yeah, but in Arizona. Yeah. Big ass house, and then houses around it that housed the employees that were there. Pa trabajar ahí. Pa trabajar ahí mm -hmm. forever. Yeah. Um. So it's like, then yeah, landing strip, all kinds of crazy stuff that you're like. Lo que hace el dinero, compa. Like, just yeah. wild. Yeah. Wild, bro. He had a landing strip. Todo, todo, Holy compa. Holy shit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It was, if you see that TikTok where, where they're talking about that property itself, just that property, I'm like, that, that is. loaded. Yeah, food was loaded, bro. Like, loaded. Pues, pues, tenés su isla, pues, es un tropedo, right? But then you start seeing, like, los detalles de las properties y 
No, no manches. Güey. Otro pedo. Otro, otro pedo, hijo de fuerza regida. <laughs> yeah. That's wild. Um, so I got one thing I want to bring up también. I, I don't know if you guys heard. También en Florida, del muchacho, they got arrested. Um, de Guatemala. I think he was oh, like 17. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, el que el policía se murió de ataque. De Mm. That one? Yeah, yeah, Virgilio yeah. Aguilar Mendez. Yeah. That was crazy. I, I, told, I was telling you about I, it. Personally, I think that's fucked up. It's not yeah. his fault. I don't think it's his fault. Like, and, and that's another thing. Like, you know, I feel like people don't understand when you have that language barrier. Like, he could have called somebody to come and translate or something, you know? Pero que era? Nomás estaba fuera del hotel él hablando. Estaba hablando, yeah, estaba hablando por teléfono. Este, el, el chamaquito parece que dicen que se, con su papá. Y ya llegó el policía y como el morro no hablaba mucho inglés, ni na, y según que no hablan español tampoco, porque ya, ya ve en Guatemala hay, hay muchos este, como dialectos y el morrillo no hablaba español ni inglés y, oh, y sí. eh, según dicen el policía lo empezó a forcejar y, y le encontró una, un cuchillito de lo que usan para cortar este fruta y pues... Con más razón empezaron a forcejar y como a los como a los 15 minutos de estar forcejando, el policía este, cayó y ya ahí, ahí quedó pues. Y ahí le quieren dar cargos al chamaquito que como que lo hubiera matado. Porque y, el policía le, le dio un, un ataque. ¿vale? Le corazón. dio un ataque al corazón y, y en que la, el, el forense dijo que se había muerto de una causa natural. Ellos están aferrados a, a meter de por vida al pobre morrillo. And it's sad because yo vi un TikTok where they were talking about how in this town, este policía le pegó a un pedestrian that was walking and killed him. And the, y no cop, le dieron nada. And the cop didn't get anything. They, he didn't go to jail. Literally, he didn't even get fined, I think, or he did. No, I think una, <laughs> una multa. Sí. Or, yeah, like a simple as uh, multa. And I'm just like, dude, like, it's crazy how when the papers turned around, like, they'll do everything to get you, you know? Yeah. They blame the person. Hay mucho, hay mucho racismo todavía ahí oh, involucrado. Yeah. No, la policía se protege. Sí, se protege entre ellos mismos. Sí. Pero pues eso que le quieren dar todas esas, esas cadenas así larguísimas en la cárcel al pobre Morrillo. Y es hasta menor de edad. El Morrillo apenas cumplió creo 18. Y pues lo quieren meter de por vida. Damn. Pero sinceramente no creo que puedan. The is... Un buen abogado. Sí, un buen abogado y, y sale, sale libre el morrillo. Porque pues. Well, so no. porque that's Florida sí. too, man. Florida. Oh, Florida, yeah. Yeah. Florida. Si se llega, si se llega a dejar, si lo, si lo chingan. Si, si se llega a dejar, si. No, pero vi que mucha gente. Lo pero está ya apoyando. ahorita ya mucha gente lo está ya mm -hmm. apoyando y todo eso. And that's why I like TikTok because I feel like when there's injustice, people speak up about it. Like there's. You know? And the media doesn't. Pero, sí. pero eso ya tiene rato que pasó pues, y apenas este, salió a, a luz eso, pues. Yeah. Pues igual Porque que ya, según dicen, ya tiene un rato en la cárcel. El muchacho que mató a su mamá, you guys heard about that one? Oh, we, my oh. sister's been wanting to talk about that. Do you guys know about it or no? No, I just heard about it because he told me. ¿Usted qué sabe de ese rollo, compa? Del morrillo pues, que mató pues, a su mamá. Yo pienso que sí fue él que lo hizo, compa. Ojalá, no lo forzó, ojalá, ojalá, ojalá y me equivoque. Pero... Yo, creo, yo creo que el, pa, el padrastro lo hizo and is trying to blame him because I did saw a video where the padrastro has like a fa had a family on the side. Mm. Y que luego, luego que lo agarraron a él, que... El papá se fue con su familia, lo que sea. Y en corte, estaba viendo que el niño como preguntando a su abuela qué pasó. Like, what happened? Or like, you know? Pero si se pone a pensar, ya un morrillo de esa edad, ¿por qué se va a estar culpando y diciendo cómo la mató? Este, dando, dando toda la información. Detalles, Pero está sí. malito, ¿no? Nah, hasta que yo sepa, no lo han declarado malito. Eso era esto, que sí tenía algo. No, no sé qué, pero yeah, puede ser, se, puede se ser. Ve medio, se ve medio raro, medio diferente el niño, pues, este... Te queda así como callado y todo eso. Puede ser que sí, sí tenga algo. Just Pero ojalá y logren este, investigar bien todo porque sí está canijo también. Ey, ¿pero dijo por qué la mató o no? No dijo por qué la mató, eso no, no lo quiso decir. Nomás cuando le, le preguntaron que por qué lo hizo. Que sí si lo hizo y dijo que dijo sí. Que, que, dijo que sí y después dijo que quería un abogado. Pero es como le digo, la, la policía no, no es tonta. Porque habían dicho también como que, que a lo mejor el papá lo forzó a hacerlo o algo, ¿no? Puede ser que sí, pero pues este ahí 
si ponga si lo hizo él o no lo hizo la, la policía tiene videos de las cámaras tiene este y lo dice que le habló a su compa no después de hacerlo y sí, que le avisó que a su le... compa que ella hice esto esto uh -huh, y lo otro uh -huh. Ya yeah, no sé, I didn't Imagínate, hear a lot of stories. Que le, que le había dicho que había matado a su mamá. Que, que había, <coughs> y a la policía le dijo también que le había cortado el cuello, que no sé qué. Que, y este, quién sabe, pero sí, sí, está medio cañón eso. Lo que sucedió ahí, pues. ¿Sabe qué será la historia detrás de ahí? Ese, ese, eso es lo, lo más canijo. Y ya ve que en el TikTok andan todos de... Queriendo hacer la de, de fiscales y de... Sí. Y, yeah. Dicen que esto que lo otro, que... Por eso este... Pero yo, yo pienso que la policía tiene suficientes pruebas. Porque encontraron el cuchillo. En el cuchillo están las huellas. Mm. Y este... Tienen una cámara. Pues tenían, fue, tenían cámara en el cuarto, ¿no? Sí, tienen, tienen un video y... Y no creo yo que la policía se va a estar aferrando de tenerlo ahí en la cárcel si saben que no fue él. No, ¿Y el sí. papá está del mismo tamaño del morro o qué? Mm, sí, mm, más, más o menos. Más o menos. Sí. So you never Porque know. estaban diciendo que a lo mejor fue él que entró como kind of like the kid uh -huh. and did it. Pues, that's man, where, who knows. Puede, puede ser también, that. sí puede yeah. ser. que hay, hay, puede, hay un montón de teorías. Es como, como hay digo. muchas teorías, ya. Yeah. Sí, sí, pero sí. quién sabe cuál será la, la real, pues. Van a tener que investigar muy bien todo ese desmadre y... Está triste, compadre. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know any of that. No. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, porque me preguntó no y porque sí, su hermana brought it up. My sister's been talking about it. Like, hey, have you, are you guys going to talk about it? You guys gonna... Y yeah. le digo, hey, yo no he tenido chance de ver, like, mm -hmm. too much into it. And then yeah. I told him, but he's like, I haven't, I haven't, it hasn't popped up for me either, no, you know? really? Oh, yeah, it popped up for me. So I was like, and then I asked him about it. He's like, oh, yeah, I saw this and that. But I was yep. like, personally, I don't think he did it. From like what other people were saying and stuff. Está como dividido todo el, el desmadre. Muchos creen que sí fue él, muchos que no, y está dividido. Y especialmente porque, como dicen, si es autista, if he's autistic, I've mm -hmm. worked with autistic kids. My nephew's autistic. So, I mean, not everybody's the same, everybody's different, but you know, like, their men the way their mentality works. And if he is that, like, they had to have, like, su padrastro had to have had him do it or amenazarlo or something, you know? Sí. That would make more sense for why it, it worked, the plan worked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, mejor se dejó manipular, pues. Pues sí, con que eres un niño y si alguien te dice, si no lo haces, te voy a matar a ti. Or, you know, te da miedo. Like, you know, can, their yeah. mind doesn't mm -hmm. work like we would think, you know, like, what are you going to do to me? You can't kill me. Like, you know what I mean? So. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Um, cambiando de tema, este, did you guys do a rosca? No. Yeah, are you guys into that? Are the, or... No, we don't have family out here. Well, we do, but like not like that. No. You guys? Yeah, this is. Yeah, did it? Did yeah, we did it. Ah, uh, see. Sí. Yeah, tamales. Well, I mean, no, but my son got one at home, and then they did it again, and I think my wife got it. So do you guys got tamales? Uh, hosting. Say, do you guys do tamales? I feel like. Well, not... this is like the first time que que this happens that like we do the rosca oh, really? thing, and it's like I mean we've never really nunca hemos celebrado, mm -hmm. oh. pero siempre dicen oh que hay que comprar una arle pues yeah mi compadre llegó con una y we did it and then well he got one and Ivan got one. Mm -hmm. so, pero qué les tocó? Pues oh, no, 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 we haven't planned it out. Oh okay. But we're gonna do something because yeah. yeah. normally well at least the way we would do it is like el que mm -hmm. le toca el monito mono, el primero. Yeah. Uh -huh. has to has to host or has to put up the food. Yeah, nosotros lo hacemos like en my dad's family es que el que le toca el mono les toca cocinar algo. There you go. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to cook something and he's mm -hmm. probably going to cook something and a ver dónde caiga the hosting. And then um, my in-laws they did it. Yeah. Yeah. And then my wife got it. I think they each got one like I think uh I think her sister got one, my wife and then on her brother's side, they somebody in his family got it. So it kind of ended up being like all the families got it, yeah. you know, like uno. So, pues nos vamos a juntar, nos puro, puro show, compa, para hacer fiesta. Puro pecho chelo. Yeah. Excusa. Puro show. The traditional um, rosca o era algo diferente? No, it was the traditional. The traditional? Yeah, the round one. Because, uh, have you ever seen the one que de Nutella? No. <laughs> no. Dude, that's just fire, bro. Is it? <laughs> nah. That's just fire, bro. No. Nah, it was a bueno. traditional. You nunca la había probado, la neta. No? No. It's good. It was, it was right. It's like a concha. Hay, hay, hay un güey que es una de, una de birria. 
Oh, yeah, oh I saw that one. TikTok, yeah, viendo, yeah, pero ahí yeah. sí le vas a querer cortar un no, pedazote. No, a ver, dame, güey. <laughs> con su consumé y todo. Se yeah, sí, sí, vi ese, sí, ese. Oh, that's pretty cool. Mira, perros, nah, they just did the traditional ones. Traditional ones? Yeah. Mm-hmm. ¿Tan caras o no? I, well, I was going to say, I don't know if you saw. I uh, think they are, ¿no? Puede estar como... Like 50 bucks? Sí. Oh, snap. 30, 50 bucks. You saw that lady at Costco? I was going to say, did you guys see TikTok? <laughs> wow, what happened? The, 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 I saw two videos. Oh, I only saw one. Había una señora. Uh, I didn't even know they had Costco in Mexico. Oh, yeah, they do. Um, they got I Costco didn't know. I'm saying, I, I didn't know. Pero había una señora, because it seems like it was in Mexico. Mm-hmm. Y tenía su carro lleno, güey. Like, Más de 100 roscas. I mean, it was, it was crazy. Para revenderla. Para revender. Uh, y, y la gente, pues, they're like, hey, what the fuck? You know, whatever. Madre. And then they started taking it from, like, some Black Friday <laughs> shit, güey, you know? Oh, snap. Yeah. But you know what? They've been doing that in Mexico, bro, where con people were... Ajá, uh-huh, con los yeah. pasteles y las empanadas, compa. Just, iban a comprar a la casco y ellos iban a revender. Uh-huh. And they were making hella money. I oh, just feel like it's getting crazy. Like those Stanley cups. I'm a girl man and I'm not like I would it's... not pay that much for a fucking cup. No? Like you got me. No. I have Stanley's, but I didn't pay fucking like <laughs> no, I didn't pay like 50 bucks for them. I paid I had them a lot since for a while, so I paid like I think the most I paid is 35 bucks. Yeah, that sounds but, like, average. Yeah, but like mm-hmm. dude, paying 50 or a hundred dollars, yeah, se pasan. No. Y es porque cambian el color, right? That, yeah. That's pretty much it. Like, yeah. Yo, but my compa Leo was saying that um, if you have the lunch, the lunchbox cups mm-hmm. from back in the day, mm-hmm. you know how the the working class yeah. had those, mm-hmm. la, la lonchera y que tenía su vasito, uh-huh. that those are worth a lot of money. The original ones. No, I don't have those. I don't have those either. Mm-hmm. ¿Cómo yo? No. No, tampoco. No, 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 no soy muy así de andar llevando lonche. <laughs> Uh, Pero de Stanley o... Yeah, they were the Stan- I mean, the Stanley brand has been yeah. around for so no, long. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying that's the one that's worth a lot. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, the old school OG Stanley uh, cup that would oh, come shit. in the little lunchbox so that, they have that working one. class would take to work. And then they work. have the yeah. other ones where, like, the coffee, <clears throat> where you take the mug off. The- yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, they have those. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, no. I just have regular ones. But, like, se pasan. And I feel like that's the business. You buy them and to resell them or whatever. But I'm like, bro, like... A veces las viejas sí exageran. La neta que sí se pasan. Están vendiéndolos en se el pasan. Facebook como por 100 dólares. ¿Los rojos o okay? qué? ¿Los de Valentine? Yeah, ¿Los de Valentine? ¿Tienes de estos? Yeah. I was like, no. I was like, yo no voy a pagar 100 dólares. Ni que estoy una pendeja. A mí lo que no, I don't like, I don't like that cup because it spills. Yeah. To me that makes no sense. If you got to hold your cup like this all the time, mm-hmm. like, I don't think that's worth it. You know, yeah. unless you're going to leave it in the car, yeah. like, you're going to carry it and put it in the car, cool. Yeah. Pero si lo vas a traer pa, like, so many other on your friends. trip or something, like, who the hell wants to hold a... I don't want to hold a cup like that. <laughs> yeah, like, no manches. Pero si, si cabe in the cup holder? Yeah, like, it does car? fit. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Certain ones. My, Certain wife, ones? my wife got one for Christmas. Uh-huh. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, you're you like, got, no, no, no. <laughs> not for me. Uh-huh. She got one from Christmas. Though. I mean, she wanted one, right? <laughs> I was like, Damn. Not, not for me, me, but she wanted one. Yeah. She wanted one. And then um, she got one for Christmas, and she used it today, yeah. like actually out. A certain but color? I, uh, it was like orange. Oh. Yeah. It was, Does she I'm, want a certain color though? Get oh no, nah, she don't. I don't think she cares. She oh, doesn't. She's. I don't know. I'm yeah, just, nah, yeah. she don't yeah. care. But today was the first day because of you all, you know. And to me, it was more like we went to the doctor. I told you guys, and I'm like, to me, it's more like on the lo vas a poner que no se caiga, que no lo vayas a tumbar, because yeah. now you're like at a doctor's office. There's a computer. There's a woo, whatever, whatever, you know. Mm-hmm. I'm like, to me. That's the issue, you know, carrying that. But if you if you have it and you leave in your car and then yeah. the chido, it's going to be cold or it's going to be hot. Yeah. It's going to do the job. I think that's cool. But mm-hmm. but she carried it. She didn't complain. Yeah. There's so many other brands that are way better that don't even spill. Like Simple Modern is one of my favorite. And well, they, has it. Stanley has the other ones that don't spill, too. I mean, they make there's tons of cups. I mean, yeah. mm-hmm. the cups are not the issue. Yeah, it's the brand. I, what people are saying is like, how fucking stupid are we? Are we forgetting to hydrate ourselves? Like you got to have a five cups to hydrate you know like i just feel like for me personally i love ice cold water like when i drink water i have to have it cold i can't have loop al tiempo oh. yeah, yeah. me asco i don't know if, i think it's just nasty like, uh, my my water is actually lukewarm right now yeah i like i like so you're drinking water. tea pues está al tiempo <laughs> está al tiempo <laughs> compa es como tomarte una chela mm. te la vas a tomar caliente o al tiempo no, it's not the same. No, it's not the same, though. No, 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 no. I, You know what? I don't know. I've never been a huge fan of, like, cold water. Oh, yeah. Same. I don't know why. Pero una coca, bien fría. Una chela, bien fría. Oh, yeah. yeah. A, a gusta, y el café, bien caliente. Me gusta yeah. el agua como enfriarla, así como al, al natural. Como, por decir, ponerla allá afuera ahorita. Ajá. Uh-huh. 
Eh, como a unos, ponerle unos, that unos shit. 10, 20 funny. minutos a agarrar y tomárselo. We'll buy, like, a mí me sabe diferente que meterla al refri. Pero no está súper fría, está como no, sí, al está tiempo como, nomás. Sí, está, ¿O te gusta el tiempo entre, que esté? Entre fría y <coughs> calentita, pues. Este, y me sabe, me sabe mejor así el agua. Como que me sabe diferente el sabor. ¿Te imaginas que estás en los glaciers? Okay, sí, onda? en los glaciares. Well, we've actually allá. tried, um, cuando fuimos a acampar con mi familia. Oh, sí. We've en la, mon en la montaña. Really really bueno. ¿Filter o no? No. Así no, nomás. Del río. Ajá. They have like a, this, la like, area where you go and get water. Pero ponen like letreros ahí que dicen que esa agua puedes tomarla. Ajá. Uh -huh. oh, They actually yeah. put signs on there that it gets... Baja de la, de la montaña. It's like, for instance, are you guys... Like, I feel like people taste the difference between water. Like, there's certain people that can only drink spring water, and there's certain people that can drink purified water. What are you guys? I, pre I prefer spring. Um, but it's like, if I drink purified, and then I switch to spring, you can taste it. Exactly, mm -hmm. yeah. But, if, yeah, so, but I prefer spring. Yeah, yeah. I prefer purified. I don't you really care. You can't taste the difference between water? I'm sure I can taste it, but I just don't care. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, me vale, like, I'm cool. Yeah. Con que no me va a envenenar, I'm good. Nah. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I don't well, care. they say we're purified porque le ponen, like, chemicals. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. it's like, I'd rather drink spring. Yeah, that is true. But I drink purified. I mean, I'm drinking purified right now. Mm -hmm. Pero, yeah, you could definitely taste it. I usually go and, like, ah, oh, man, I gotta, I'm, what I am against is buying the bottle of water. I'm not a fan really? of buying that. You yeah. Buy the gallon, the five gallon. I'll do a dispenser. five gallon one, and then typically I have we have the water dispenser, and that's usually morely more for like hot water or si va gente like hey you, you want to make an instant coffee or you know yeah. they don't want coffee but whatever you know yeah. we use it for that. Yeah. también it has cold water too, uh, but we typically do the water from the fridge we, with the, the filter and all that. We like, have the filter water, but we have water <clears throat> bottles, so when we're on the go. Water but that, a mí no me gusta que la gente las deja llenas. That's it him. bothers me. Like, I, I don't mm -hmm. know. Like, it feels like yeah. a waste. It, it feels like I'm contributing to the waste with the bottles. Mm -hmm. So, like, we only buy it if, like, people are going to be over. Like, a, a big group. Yeah. Because then, pues, you, I don't have that many cups or people no quiere batallar or they're going to spill it, you know? Mm -hmm. Pero for the daily, for us, yeah. we don't buy it. Si va a mi casa, compa, y hay, o van, es because we bought them for a party, ahí están y quedaron, you know? And we deal with the same thing. Like, my kids will open it, no se la acaban, and we're like, is it yours? I don't know. Really, bro? Now you have to throw it away. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So, I don't know. I'm just like that. I'm cheap as hell. Hay mucha gente que eso también con la soda, nomás. No, it's not being cheap. It's Le pega un traguito y la dejan ahí. No, no se la toman nada, compa. Ahí, nomás. ¿Por qué me ves a mí? <laughs> <laughs> Tire la directo. Tire la directo, eh. Sí, pero por eso no. Mi compa siempre tiene bottles, ¿ah? Uh. And you get the big But, one too, right? The yeah. Five gallon? También te me dieron el five gallon and, and the bottle. Um, yeah. Bottle yeah, 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 same. The same thing. For me. Um, for, give me like two minutes. We're going to take a quick break. Yeah. And then we're going to wrap up. Mm -hmm. All right. good um well to wrap this things up to wrap it up este i wanted to ask you like what's going on with uh Jaivita. i know you guys are on uber eats now yeah uh doordash También. También. those are only two right now right yeah. mm -hmm. so you why there's can... more is there well, more there's gotta be more right? well yeah. postmates yeah. is with uber postmates, so, so mm -hmm. postmates. yeah so technically doordash uber and postmates we haven't added mm -hmm. grubhub Well, in reality, the only reason why we have Uber Eats and DoorDash, not to see, sound like whatever, but they called us to go on because they go based off like your reviews, how many people look at your website. Well, we don't have a website, but like Google your, search yeah. or whatever. And then if they see like, oh, like they're getting like good reviews or whatever, they'll call you because DoorDash called us first. Hey, like we want to set you guys up and this and that. I was like, okay, whatever. So then Uber Eats called me. Hey, I'm ready to set you guys up. We see you guys are on DoorDash. You guys have so many you know, people that purchase, we want you guys too. And then, yeah. How, and what are you seeing more now? Ahorita que ya tienes los dos. Well, in reality, <laughs> I feel like Uber Eats. Mm -hmm. Sí, like, se ve yeah, más. En los dos, los todo. primeros dos días, había un chingo de órdenes compared to DoorDash, pues. I've, just the area, pues también, you know? I feel like they, people order more on Uber Eats que DoorDash. Yeah. I es, think so. Es más popular, creo, el Uber. Sí, el Uber Eats, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it's more popular. But you guys have that going on, mm -hmm. so that's awesome. That's badass. Yeah. Good for the business. Oh heck yeah! yeah. Para yeah. El and not just that. I just mm -hmm. feel like people are trusting us to feed them. You know what I mean? I yeah. feel like that's the biggest thing because, like, I'm always like, how no, I said yesterday, I'm cheap. No, it's not being cheap. You work hard for your money, 
and you double think you think about it like do i want to spend on money uh, my money on food or do i want to cook you know what i mean or right. i don't know i just feel like you think about it like you then you check the pressure like damn that's just expensive or this you know then you're like you know what it's good food though i mean personally me i'm the type of person who, i mean i'm going to gastar dinero en comida yo nunca he sido así siempre si si es algo que está bueno i'm willing to pay yeah. you know i agree I love food, so yeah. I'm right there. Too. Hell yeah. Yeah. But um, yeah, we have we have new stuff coming this year, you know. Gracias a Dios y gracias a, a los clientes, a todos. Sí, pues. Cuéntales la nueva noticia. Ahí, pues, más que todo estamos este, trabajando en poner otra otra troca aquí en Aurora. Hell yeah. Sí, es algo que estamos trabajando, si Dios quiere, aquí en un mes, un It's mes. It's still surreal. Medio. Todavía... No lo podemos creer Ay. que gracias a todos que nos han apoyado, la verdad, it's, it's a dream come true. Personally, I've always said and I always will, it wasn't my dream, it was my husband's dream, but I've learned to love it. I've learned to, I mean, I love customer service. I love to talk to people. I love to meet new people. So doing it, it's it's been amazing. And the fact that like people support us and have been able to help us make our dreams come true, it's it's surreal, you know? Being able to have another food truck within a year, it's not something that, that So, el plan es de tener dos locations. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sí. Well, es el pensado ahorita, pues. Estamos <coughs> todavía averiguando. Ya oficialmente ya tenemos la otra trailer. Nomás ya la están arreglando. You know, the, están the preparando last como la, a los gustos. Yeah. Um, so, we, we have a lot of ideas. You know, porque mucha gente que viene siempre nos quiere agarrar para París. You know? Mm. And we can't because we're at a set location. So, it's really hard to move and go to a party because then your regulars are looking for you. Hey, where are you guys at? What are you doing? And, you know, so, so idea más de él es que, you know, hacer fiestas, hacer, you know. Como eventos. Pues, Catering, ¿verdad? Right? Ah, sí, uh -huh. pero para. a la misma vez también, este, la estoy pensando a ver cuál va a ser la mejor, la mejor decisión, pues, si ponerla en un lugar esta, uh, ya como establecida, que se quede ahí, o agarrarla como para puras fiestas y todo eso. Más eventos. Sí, sí. pero el, conce el concepto va a ser diferente, <coughs> eso sí. No va a ser diferente, diferente del todo, pero sí va a ser un poquito diferente porque a esta, mi pensar es nada más puros como tacos. Maybe, puro tacos. o puro mariscos. So. Okay. Una puros de dos, o es puros tacos o es puro marisco. Pero y acá tienen la combinación. Yeah. Aquí tenemos combinación tacos y mariscos. We just, I feel like we want to do something different. You know what I mean? Something mm -hmm. that people don't see. I feel like everywhere you go, it's tacos, tacos, mm -hmm. tacos, tacos. You know what I mean? And yeah. mm -hmm. sometimes you're like, I want something else. I want, you know, mariscos es nuestra fortaleza si decimos, you know, nuestro. Tu fuerte. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I feel like having mariscos because. And where we're at right now, people call us, oh, tienen ostiones, o tienen esto, o tienen otro. We don't, you know, we can't, we only have the uh, small things. So I feel like doing something like that would mm -hmm. also help, you know, because I feel like Mariscos is always just the restaurant, you know, restaurants, restaurant, restaurant, you know, and I feel like es having a food truck. Por decir, si, si nos dedicamos nada más a puro marisco, tenemos opciones de traer como ostiones, como el escalot, el callo de hacha, creo que. Callo de hacha. Mm -hmm. sí, tenemos langostinos este, que piden langostinos. mucho langostinos sí. van uh, yeah. so ya platillos un poquito más populares más fuertes sí. o lo más pedido lo más popular uh, pues mm -hmm. uh, yo habría unos platillos nuevos ya yeah. yeah. sí unos platillos diferentes eh, como le dije el lago um, si hacemos un concepto de mariscos yo quisiera hacer como tipo como cuando tú pides un cóctel o un ceviche o lo que sea, pero a tu gusto. Like tener diferente, porque a muchos les gusta como el mango ceviche o hay otros que oh. le echan jícama, que le echan puro mm -hmm. pepino, que, like, you know, you, it's like a, kind of like chipotle style. You get to choose what you want on your bowl or whatever. Oh, that would be you know cool. I mean? mm -hmm. Something like that. And I just feel like uh, mariscos, I'm not a big seafood person, but I mean, I'll eat it, but there's out, people out there que les encanta los mariscos, que mm -hmm. les encanta, you know? Sí, yeah. that, that's a pretty cool idea. Yeah. Ya tener, mm -hmm. hey, ok, vas a querer un ceviche. ¿Qué quieres en tu ceviche? Boom, uh -huh. boom, 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 boom. You know? That sounds pretty dope. Yeah, so it's little things like that. <coughs> we, we're not saying that. Están trabajando la idea. Yeah, yeah, we're still debating on what to do, mm -hmm. what, what people would like, you know? Nice. Something different. 
I don't think you guys would go wrong with anything though, because I love the food. I mean, you yeah. guys already know I'm like there yeah. every other week. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, and it, and it's true. Like I tell, we have customers that we have so many regulars, and it's funny because they say like I'm not biased. I just love your guys' food. I was like, no, like that's cool because you could taste the flavor, you could taste the freshness, the type of meat quality that we use in general, the product. Todo yeah. el producto que usamos que es fresco, no es, you know, no es de días o lo que sea. Oh. That's nah, he, casi, casi todo se va de yeah. al diario. Casi todo se acaba. Él tiene que ir todos los días mm -hmm. por el producto. Todos los días, you know? So, it helps out a lot. Like, casi, casi todo se acaba del, del, del día. Y el siguiente día en la mañana, surtir todo. Mm -hmm. Ya empezar otra vez. Sí, ya darle otra vez. Yeah. But I mean, there, there is going to be changes to our um, new menu right now, too, because I feel like during the seasons, there's stuff that's ordered more than others, como mm -hmm. like our papas mixtas. Um, I feel like that's something that we might change. I don't know. There's just like little changes that we are going to make to our regular menu because mm -hmm. I feel like uh, hay unas que se venden y no se vende. Y también para um, perder producto, como hemos mm -hmm. tenido que tirar cosas porque we don't like to reuse stuff. You know what I mean? ¿Qué es lo que ahorita en invierno casi no se vende? O lo que has visto, like, oh, this is kind of slow down. Sinceramente, casi todo se vende. Nothing. What are you guys going to change? Well, it's know, like, right? it's random. That's the thing. Oh, like, it could change? Yeah, like. Yo creo que si tuviera que quitar algo del menú, eh, no, 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 no. Está difícil. No, no que it's quitarle. hard because, like, today, like, let's say today, se van a vender un chingo de mariscadas. Tomorrow, it could be just tacos. Like, mm -hmm. it's random. I feel like our, our main thing, main thing is siempre the tacos, the torta, the quesadilla. And the Those are, like, for yeah, sure. That's, mm -hmm. Or, like, the ceviche. Va. I mean, not really. Ceviche y aguachile. Sí, ahora últimamente. Se el aguachile, bien, yeah. I feel like that's the, the main thing que se vende. El, el ramen. The ramen, oh my bueno. gosh. That's everybody's favorite. Esa madre si se venden chingos. Mm -hmm. Y este, no, estaría muy And not just that, our portion size. I feel like people love it, you know? Yeah, big portions. When you, yeah, yeah, when you go to places, like, then, I, uh, cuando fue ayer, no, que fuimos a comer pho. Um, fuimos a comer, and se ve que te dan mucho, pero es puro caldo. No te dan ni carne, ni, ni, ni el este, la sopa. Like y the Sinceramente, noodles. se siente feo ir a un lugar, porque este, uno va y ordena y... ¿Te quedas y con hambre? Y poquito y todavía queda con hambre. ¿Te quedas con hambre y el cheque ya no está a 50? No sé si uno sea muy tragó. Yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to go pop in for that ramen, though. Hey, I'm yeah. going to have to come eat here, bro, because I don't know if I can eat outside there. Yeah. In the cold. Just, just and the verano está chido yeah. con paperón. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's yeah. Our, that's our hope one day to have a restaurant but right now you know i just feel like it's it, it it's a lot like people i feel like a lot of people don't understand how much it takes to have a business in general whether it's a food truck whether it's a restaurant like mm. it it's expensive you know what i mean and especially not having all the money to do it you know you still have to hustle you know we oh have, for sure we have to buy another food truck it wasn't just like, oh, yeah, we have the money. Let's just get it at the food truck. No, like, we work every single day. You got to hustle. Yeah, yeah, you have to hustle. Le tienes que echar putazo. Y la gente ahorita en el invierno va y se quema sus tacos ahí volada y vámonos. Oh, oh yeah. 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 No falla. O en el carro, vámonos. Mm -hmm. En el carro ahí. Comen. I feel like that's when food hits them the best. The you best. Know? Oh, yeah. You take it, eat it in the car, relax, watch TV. Nowadays, everybody has apps on their phone, you know? Yeah. Well, maybe watch I, on YouTube. And it's cool, though, because you always see, like, people come and get their food and they'll be in their car and they say, ay, mira, están chingando bien macizo los tacos bien ricos. Se ve. <laughs> <laughs> you know, se ve bien a gusto. Me, este, me da gusto sus... o no. Luego. La neta que sí. Luego cuando a la gente le, le, le gusta lo que uno hace, se siente bien uno mismo. No es, no es, no es tanto por el dinero. Pues it's not. Que, Seeing people come back. Estás haciendo algo bonito, algo que lo disfrutan. Yeah. It's awesome. It really is. Because hey. they become your friends. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. tenemos un señor que, um, él viene, he comes at least two, three times a week. And he's always like, oh my gosh, like, I can't get enough of this. And I'm like, Dude, thank you for coming, man. Like, it just, it, it feels, you, yeah, because yeah. it's like, wow, like, people actually support you and they care, you know, it's like, it's like how I was telling somebody the other day, like, if you compare us to a McDonald's and you, let's say we fuck up somebody's order, that person's not going to come back. But if they go to McDonald's and McDonald's fucks up their order, they're going to go back. Like, why do people do that? You know, like, McDonald's has, they're fucking millionaires, billionaires, like, you know, but it's like, you can't fuck up you have to be perfect and it sucks because sometimes you're not you know like when we get bit, stuff happens yeah but people don't understand that you know what i mean like we've messed up we try not to but like the other day we were so busy que se nos olvidó un taco una señora and i told him i was like dude like if 
I had her address, I'd go and take it to her. Like, that's how bad I want to not lose a customer. You know what I mean? It's And it's not about like, oh, like, oh, whatever, F her. No, like, I yeah. like you spent your money to come here and support us. I feel bad. Like, um, can I that's I feel like that logic is that's that's a good way to think. I, I think I told the story out here before about the churros, bro. Yeah, we did. Yeah, where we go to this churro spot in uh I think it's East or West Andy. Mm -hmm. Um Shama Churros Tinoco or something like that. Mm -hmm. And we went, we ordered our churros, they gave us our box, we get home, and it's like a 15 to 20 minute drive. Uh -huh. We get home and we're like, oh, this isn't our order. Like they gave us the wrong box, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And my wife said, well, just call them. Let them know, you know, that they, they didn't give you your order. Yeah. So les hablamos, and, we're, and they're like, oh, yep, I'm sorry. Like, we, you guys took the wrong order. It's, it's, and mm -hmm. then she's like, we'll drop it off. We'll drop off your order in a little bit. What's your address? Mm -hmm. And they went all the way to my house yeah. to drop off my order. I was like, right. what the? F and that makes you feel good. Like, I know manches. They'll have a customer forever. Exactly. I'm always going to be a customer. And that's what happened to us. So uh, not so long ago, we actually were going to take Uber off. We really mm -hmm. were because I got so pissed because people steal food. They steal the food. And it. so I don't know what day it was, but somebody comes, picks up the order. So before they pick up the order, I have to have them confirm the order because um, it lets them know that they're on their way to deliver the order. So that person didn't confirm it. He just, well, because I had to do it until after the situation happened, but he would just show me the name and I'd hand him the order. Okay, whatever. So that person left. So then somebody else shows up. And he's like, I'm here for so-and-so's order. And I was like, oh no, somebody already came to pick it up. They're like, no, they didn't. They dropped it. They dropped the order, which means he dropped it to where it says he wasn't delivering the order anymore. So he took the order. Mm -hmm. So ever since then, I've had people confirm it. So I had to call customer support. That lady didn't get the order. She didn't reorder. And I'm just like, if it was me as a customer, I think it's the restaurant that fucked up, not the driver or whoever came to pick up the order. Mm -hmm. So if I had the lady's address, because it didn't even show her number or anything. So I didn't have any of her information. Right. I was like, if I did, I would have personally taken her those tacos because I'm like, I would have been pissed. I really mm -hmm. wanted something and I didn't get my order, you know? So what happens on the other side for that person? Does that person still get charged? No, we'll no. Uh, Uber no. Will refund really them the money. Oh. Yeah, they'll give them back their money. But, but that driver messed up. Yeah. So um, the good thing is that us as a restaurant, you could actually uh, put information on the driver, but I couldn't put anything on there because he had dropped the order. So it doesn't show who. Ya no te enseñó quién era. Mm -hmm. And but Uber could probably figure it out, right? Yeah, pero eso es vale madre. Oh. It was just mm -hmm. a. It's like a one order type of thing. Like, yeah. ah, let it go, whatever. Yeah. yeah. But it's just like, it's little things like that where I, if, <clears throat> if I could do something to remediarlo para que esa persona no estuviera molesta o lo que sea, I would do it. Because okay. having a client, whether they buy one little thing, is so valuable because they're going to come back. You know what I mean? Yeah. They, they waste their money to go. I don't know. I just, that's how I think. I, hey, yeah. that changed my perspective on it. Like, I'm already on, on some good service type shit only. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I mean, when they were, like, I was shocked when they were like, "We're gonna, yeah. we're gonna go drop it off." It's yeah. not closed. That's mm -hmm. that lejecitos. Yeah. And then yeah, we'll it be make, there. It makes you like, damn, they like, actually care yeah. about what they're doing. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay. Yeah. I was. I thought they were just gonna be like, oh, what's your name? Whenever you come back, you have a credit here, yeah. or something, whatever, you know. I, mm -hmm. Yeah. And they're like, no, we'll we'll drop off your order. We apologize. I was yeah. like, oh snap, y'all got a customer forever for yeah. real. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. badass. Yeah, I wow. mean we've done that. Like we had a lady that her, her taco también que oh whenever you come back, don't worry, I'm not gonna get, give you one. I'll give you two or three. You know what I mean? Because yeah, yeah. yeah. I, and I feel mm -hmm. like people are like appreciative of that. Yeah. They're all right, yeah. cool. Mm -hmm. Y no es por tanto. Well, I don't even know. No es tanto de que quieras algo free, sino que you just let them know, hey, y'all yeah. messed no? up. Yeah. You know La and. Is ya que te den algo, mm -hmm. eso ya es extra. You know, yeah. you're like, oh, mm -hmm. cool. I appreciate it. Exactly. You do care. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But. But yeah. Well, with that being said, um, that's why we appreciate you guys being the sponsor for this pod because I know you guys really do care. Hell yeah. Heck yeah. Thank you guys. No, thank you, man. Yeah. We're so happy to have met you guys and to have a relationship and stuff. Like we you guys are awesome you guys. people, man. Literally. Yeah. Gracias, gracias. Igualmente. Un saludo a todos los clientes ahí de las jaivitas que siempre nos van a apoyar ahí, pues. Barrera. Se les agradece al barbón. Barbón. Shout out. He's, yeah, he's one of a kind, man. Him and his wife. Awesome people, man. Always supporting. Always. Always there, man. They're, I'm telling you, I could name so many people. And people be like, damn, y'all weird for remembering names. But no, it's just like, it makes you feel good. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Customers. Muchas gracias por todo el apoyo. All the glasshopper. Carlos. Todos ellos, ¿verdad? Oh, Carlos. Yeah, Carlos. man. 
No, pues sigan echando ganas, man, y sigan Intentado. los sueños, sí, como dicen no. ustedes. No. Sí, es de, de darle hasta que, hasta que tope, todo el mundo ya andamos ahí en ese, uh -huh. en esta cosa de la comida. Es, es, es bonito, es, este tipo de negocio es bonito, conoce uno mucha gente y, yeah. y este, es, es este, bonito ver la, la cara de las personas cuando les gusta algo, muchas personas que dicen, no, está muy bueno, está muy bueno y eso se les agradece, pues. Yeah. Because I just feel like being in the food industry, everybody makes a lot of same stuff, similar mm -hmm. things, you know what I mean? But not everybody cooks the same. Not everybody puts the passion in the food. And, you know, like, like I said, my husband, he gets down, you know, and it's not like just voltea la carne lo que sea. No, you have to figure out what seasoning we're going to put, what kind of mm -hmm. carne we're going to use, the tortillas, the salsa, everything, you know? De todo, yeah. todo. Yeah. Que hay muchos que lo hacen, lo hacen por, por pasión y, y muchos que lo hacen por dinero. Es este, pero si lo hace por dinero, a veces se terminan decepcionando porque no ven los resultados este, que a lo mejor se esperan y terminan tal vez vendiendo su negocio y, o, o retirándose del business. Mm -hmm. Pero cuando le gusta algo, cuando le gusta eso, ahí se queda de necio. Yeah. Aunque no, le, no vayan bien las cosas, pero ahí está porque le gusta lo que hacen. Hasta que pegue. Hasta que pegue. Yeah. Mm. Insistencia. No, but seriously, thank you guys so much, literally. I feel like also you guys uh, in general, like, have brought so many customers to us. Like, we have so many people like, oh, yeah, compa sent us or, you know, this and that. So, No, we appreciate good. you guys. It's and awesome that people drive, we're... man. People drive, yeah. People, people drive, yeah. Like... So, uh, so, just... So I can wrap it up. I already ran out of battery in your camera. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to change it right now. But um, everyone, go follow La Javita. Um, I have their their Instagram link. I think the Facebook, uh, 1031. Ridgeway Avenue. Ridgeway Avenue in Aurora. I was, is it North? No. Or it's just Ridgeway, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm oh, not going to say North. 1031 North. Yeah, it is. 1031. Is it North? Yeah, 1031. North I got Ridgeway. it right. I got it right. North yeah. Ridgeway Avenue yeah. in Aurora. Uh, stay stay uh, on the lookout for um, the second food truck, depending on what you guys are going to yeah. do. And then we have a new number, too, as well. So if you guys ever... And then one thing I recommend really quick, too, is yeah. if you guys are going to order, call and place your order ahead of time and then come and pick it up. So that way you're not waiting for the order. Again, everything's cooked fresh. So it's 15 to 20 minutes, depending on what they order. Uh, but our f new phone number is 630-360-1625. I'll put that also okay. in the description. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But definitely follow the social media. Yeah. Um, I want to thank you guys again no, for coming on. Thank and you guys. And a lot everything of stuff, that you guys do. A lot of stuff is coming up this year. We're going to try to um, do like um, we want to give back to everybody that's been helping us out as well. So we want to do like a small event. Uh, we don't know what day yet, but it's like little things that are coming up. So. It's in the works. Yeah. Ya está, ya está. Este año vamos con todo, compa. Sí. Eso. Sí. Para poner la carne al asador. Ya, yeah. ayudar a la gente también. Esa es sí, otra cosa que estamos yeah. haciendo es que a lot of people have been paying for it for other people's meals. Mm -hmm. So again, we want to thank everybody that uh, donated last year. I cannot, like, I can't even express my feelings and how many people you guys have fed. Like it just, mm -hmm. it's amazing. There has been so many families that have been so grateful to have a nice hot meal. And it just, it feels so good to be able to feed families. That's awesome. No tengan pena, ustedes vayan, díganos. No, ni nos tienen que decir su situación. Just come and tell me. I want some food. I got you. Yeah. 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 Sin vergüenza. Sin vergüenza que vaya. No. No, en serio, because we've no, been there, no, you know, no. there's days no. where we went with, we didn't know what we we're going to eat the next day, and if there was only places that had that, man, no, hay, hay, hay muchas good. personas porque no, a están... lo mejor están pasando por mala situación y a lo mejor traen hambre, pues que se arrimen oh, ahí. O no, no nomás hay... eso, like, a lo mejor no les alcanza el cheque, ¿Eh? like, hemos pasado por esas situaciones, sí, sí, sí. you know. Yeah. Cosas pasan. No, no tienen todo, dinero todo para salir y comer algo diferente, you know. Yeah, yeah. never know. Exactly. Yep. So, thank you guys so much, literally, to everybody that has helped support La Jaivita, whether it was a taco, a soda, whatever it is. We're so grateful. No estuviéramos aquí sin ustedes, la neta. Oh, yeah. Arre. Saludazos yeah. a todos. Saludos. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Thank you guys for listening, for watching. Thank you guys again. Bye, guys. Estamos por otra. Bye. 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 Bye